Oh man, it feels so right. It just feels good. Feels like I'm where I need to be. Total Miner is back. It's back in business. And I think it's time for some more survival. All right, so we're back. We're back here in Total Miner. We're back here on the wonderful game. It's been a long time. It's been a very long time. I've missed it. I've missed it dearly. I've missed it so dearly. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and start up a new survival. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead over into single player. Hit new world. We're gonna go into survival, and we're gonna do a uh, semi-alpine. If you remember the uh, desert one, I'll go ahead and link right now in the top right or in the description below. Um, I'll go ahead and explain that in a little bit. We're gonna go ahead and get started first. So you can see I'm on a single player. This is my map seed. If any of you would like to play along, uh, it's a survival. I'm gonna do normal. I'm not gonna do legendary. As ridiculous as legendary is, I uh, I don't think I was quite prepared for that. There we go. What if I died in the first two minutes? That's that's impressive, I must say. No skills. Terrain is semi-alpine, and there is one thing I will do. I'm gonna make the sea level. I th no, you know what? No, I was thinking about making the sea level higher, but I don't think I'm gonna do that. Let's just do generic plain total miner survival, and the texture pack. I really like rupture, but I think I think it's got to be it's maybe do winter or autumn because autumn makes the leaves different. Nah, we'll just do original HD. No mods, mods are lame, and we're gonna go ahead and start this bad boy up. Oh wow, I am uh, I am floating in water right now. Well, at least we know we got a good uh, beachfront property waiting. I'm trying to see what is probably the best way to go. Um, let's just go ahead and get to shore and we'll figure it out then. All right, so for those of you who aren't new to the channel, you may have watched my uh, Desert Legendary Survival, which may or may not have been an absolute disaster. How do I do this? Oh God, I don't know how to craft. Oh wait, what? What? I don't know if that's a bug. I feel like it isn't though. Because I remember sapling being very difficult to get when I played uh, Survival back on the 360. Pause. Present day Jeff here, editing the video. Yeah, it turns out I actually don't know how to get a sapling still. I thought I did, and then I tested it, and it turns out it doesn't work either. So, to this day, I still don't know how to get a sapling in Legendary. That is all. But that doesn't matter. What matters right now is that I am cutting down trees, because we are on a new, new survival. A new uh, semi-alpine survival on normal. Uh, the reason I actually stopped recording the desert survival is... It wasn't even that I ran out of time or college got in the way, which, I mean, it probably would have, but um, if I have any B-roll footage, I'll show it right now of my uh, laptop and, uh, or my laptop uh, diagnosis from Best Buy, my uh, hard drive failed. So uh, I lost everything, so that includes all the footage I had. I actually had a good chunk of videos recorded, but... I literally have an excuse now. It wasn't like some uh, video corruption. I wasn't lazy. I didn't let life get in the way of my true calling. No, the Dell computer screwed me. It was also nice because it was right on the brink of my two-year warranty on the laptop. So I kind of cashed that in at a good time. But right now, we're back, and it feels so good. It feels right. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to get some wood. I'm not going to chop down this entire tree. As annoying as it is, I really hate down ha really hate having to go through the uh, act of chopping down entire trees. So we got 20 pieces of wood, and uh, I think I'm trying to find a good spot. I wish I would have uh, edited the terrain, not make the uh, sea level higher, but just edit it so that it was a little bit flatter, but not quite grasslands. But I like this spot. This is flat, and we got a beach down there that we can use. So I'm going to go ahead and try to craft. So let's see if I can learn how to do this. It has actually been quite some time since I played Total Miner. So, and I actually play on a controller instead. So it's going to take a sweet and sour second to get back into it. But everything's good. I just have to hit Y for inventory, B for inventory, sorry. And then uh, start for craft. And so I'm going to go ahead and craft myself a nice little uh, workbench. I'm going to place this workbench down right here. Open this bad boy up, 
create some sticks. You know how it goes. Anyone who's ever played a uh, Total Miner game knows. And I uh, create myself a nice little wooden hatchet. So I can take that. Go ahead and take this bad boy and uh, start chopping down some trees. Alright, this is feeling good. I, th I think this is going to be a good one. Unlike desert, where I could not grow a tree to save my life. So, I don't know how long I have to wait. Don't know if I have to punch the leaves. All I know is that this is what I was told, so... I, uh, I, th I think we'll be, uh, we'll be doing a little bit better here. Just slightly. I'm gonna chop down these trees, get all the wood I can, and then I guess, uh, I guess we'll go on a mining adventure. I mean, without shops, it's kinda like, uh... Legitimate survival. It's a survival game now. I don't want that. I want capitalism, damn it. I want to be able to buy everything I need. It's also nice how far your range is. Like you can you can chop a while if you can uh if you can use if your arms are this long, I don't know why you're not playing NBA. I don't know why you're out in the middle of nowhere chopping down trees trying to survive. Doesn't really make that much sense, but I digress. How much will we got? 15, 16 of them? That's cool. I'm just trying to think of everything I might need before I go down. Ooh, yeah. Got some, uh, got some sheep. Ooh, some iron. All right, we're already hitting it off well. I like this. All right, so the goal I established for the last video was to craft everything in the game. And six episodes in, I got nowhere near that goal. Brutally underachieved. Makes me feel like quite the failure, but that's okay. I'm going to go ahead and start chopping down... Maybe here? Should I chop down on the beach? We'll have a beach house, you know what I mean? Beach houses are good. I'll go ahead and start chopping down here, but since we're playing survival, I may as well craft a shovel. How do you craft a shovel? Is that how you craft a shovel? Oh goodness, I don't know how to craft a shovel! Tools! Wood shovel! What? It- Oh, that's a load of crap. What do you mean, some missing? I definitely have enough to craft a wooden shovel. What do you mean, some missing? What is the game doing? It's lying to me. This game is crap. Delete. Immediately uninstall. Alright, there we go. Got ourselves a shovel. Got ourselves some wood and a wood workbench. Excuse me. So now I just gotta go down, get some basalt to make a furnace so we can start smithing and we'll make it into the Iron Age. So the one thing about survival compared to Dig Deep, obviously having to craft everything is a added challenge, but I think it'll make it fun. But, um, another thing about survival is I feel like the jump between tiers is a little bit too difficult in the sense that if you go to dig deep, eventually you'll get all your, you can get all your blueprints. You don't really need to get tools. Um, since you can just go down caverns, you don't really need tools to get all your blueprints. So you can eventually just, uh, buy the, uh, the items you need while in survival, uh, without shops, you can't, you can't buy whatever you need. So... Getting the iron is pretty easy considering iron's on the surface and then uh, I believe you need carbon for steel, which I mean, see, like, I can't even mine opal, so that's kind of ridiculous, but, um, goodness, how am I going to do this? You know what, I'm just going to do straight down. I was going to do in a 3x3 three three and then do one block down each, but I don't think that's a good idea anymore, so I'm going to go ahead and fill this back in. Um, what was I saying? Uh, the, uh, the tier system in Total Miner is a little bit weird because you can get iron on the surface pretty easily. Uh, you can get iron on the surface pretty easily and then you need carbon for steel. And carbon's down, the, down, what tier is it on? Is it on Dacite? That seems a little low. Whatever, steel is down in the mines somewhere. And you need, I believe, an iron pick to get it. So that's to your first progression. But the problem is after that... You go to greenstone, so you need greenstone and gold, so you need to be able to get both those, which is difficult. And then from there, you need to get diamond, and diamond from greenstone is a ridiculous jump, because diamond is so far down. And I, th I want to say that diamond is like four tiers below. Now, I don't have any facts. I don't have any facts in front of me. Maybe I'll throw them up on screen if I'm uh, not lazy when I'm editing, but... That seems, it, I don't know, that's just like kind of ridiculous to me. But I guess we'll just have to deal with it. We're going to have to craft as much as we can. And uh, we're just going to have to keep going. So now, I think I'll do a whole lot better on semi-alpine than desert. I don't know if that was a bug or if I just suck at the game even though I've been playing it so long. But I could not for the life of me get a damn tree to grow. 
and I didn't play long enough to run into problems where I didn't have enough wood, but I feel like I would have eventually, I mean, the, the map sizes aren't that big. There can't be that many oases in a desert map, and I would have eventually run out of wood and would have had to start buying it. So, hopefully on a semi-alpine map, I won't have that problem. I'll get plenty of sapling. Um, where am I? I'm at clay. I think basalt is directly below clay, so I'll go ahead and uh, I'll see you guys when I got some basalt. Alright, I'm going to have to uh, come back because I literally mined like four blocks and my uh, pick degraded, so that's nice. That's always nice. Alright, so I've made a monumental error in thinking and realizing that sandstone is actually below, or sandstone's below clay and not a uh, basalt, or basalt. Yeah, I got a lot of stick in the uh, other series for saying basalt instead of basalt. Oh, it's going nighttime. Um, well, you know what? We're just gonna have to risk it for the biscuit because I need some uh, basalt so I can get uh, iron bricks, or uh, iron bricks, iron bars. And I know the uh, basalt is on the uh, top of the mountain here, so I'm going to go ahead and get that. I probably should have done that from the start, but I figured since I was going to start mining anyway, I might as well. But I digress. So, oh, also, I didn't find any, I need some coal. I may just, I may have to find a cavern. Because strip mining and total miner is not as, if, not as efficient in Minecraft. Um, not that that's a bad thing. I always kind of felt like strip mining was cheating anyway. Total Miner's caverns are uh, pretty legitimate, so we're going to have to go ahead and do that. I'm literally at the top of the mountain right now, and I cannot see a single, single cavern. Wait, maybe I lied? That kind of looks like a weird rock formation over there. Are you kidding me? It's gold? Ugh, and I can't even mine it. I mean, I guess I could cook my iron bars to mine it, but ugh. I'm at the top of a mountain. I'm freezing cold. Probably got hypothermia on all of my uh, extremities. Mobs are going to start spawning, and I can't find a cave. It's, uh, it's going to be a very, very sad evening. So there's this concept in making, I think it's RPG games, but all games in general, in that um, it says that you should never be more than 30 seconds away from new content, essentially. So uh, I think I think the article was on Zelda maybe Legends of Zelda but it was saying like you're never if you walk 30 seconds in any direction you're going to be nearby a uh, a new thing ooh more iron and um i really wish that applied in total miner cuz i can't find jack squat right now wait wait oh <gasps> dear lord it is lava we are in the uh, the cavern. I'm swimming around. That little guy just... Did he just kill himself? <laughs> uh, Alright, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and break this block. Let the water flow. I thought we'd let the water flow. There we go. Create some cobblestone. Maybe we'll build another cobblestone gener generator. I thought that would flow a little bit better. Maybe not. Um, didn't want to have to waste blocks, but going to anyway just for safety reasons and I really want to get out of here because there's mobs spawning above me somewhere and I really don't want them to drop down and knock me back <sighs> Ooh. oh I knew it I knew he was coming too did I not call that I can see the future because there's mobs spawning above me somewhere and I really don't want them to drop down and knock me back oh goodness that was amazing that was so amazing okay uh, can I plug these holes like there so that way I don't die actually what I may want to do is I don't have any torches but what's cool about total miner is I can actually pick this torch up and uh, oops select it and then it'll act as a uh, light source for me so uh, that's pretty cool I like that feature so let's go ahead and go downward I mean I really can't do anything but mine at the moment um, Actually, while we're here, let's go ahead and make some iron stuff. So I'll set down my little torch friend right here, pull up my workbench, and um, I think I only need four basalt basalt, basalt blocks before someone rages in the comments. Uh, furnace. There we go. So if I throw that in there. Can I use wood? I think I can use wood. If I throw that in there and then put in my wood. Yeah, it's going to drain fast, but as long as I pull it out before... Once my iron's done. So, uh, future Jeff, we'll see you when the iron's done. All right, the iron's done, and it was able to do all six bars with only, uh, 
Oh, sorry. With only one wood block, just thought I heard something. That's creepy. Um, gonna go ahead and throw down two sticks. Gonna throw down three ingots. And we, oh, that's a shovel. Do not take the shovel. That would be such a waste of iron and such a thing for me to do on my uh, first playthrough. Boom. Got it. Iron pick. We're living life, boys. Can't stop, won't stop. Easily the best total miner there is out there. Hashtag best. All right. Give me that torch. Let's keep going. We venture on into the depths. Uh, if I can find the depths. I really should be checking the walls for ores, but at the same time, I don't really think there's going to be much use in getting the ores right now. Kind of just exploring, especially for your first night. I think tomorrow... Ooh, what is that? What is that? What is that? Flint? Ooh, yeah, flint. I can make flint and steel. And then I can burn down the uh, trees I don't want. So I'm at limestone. So good thing I didn't dig straight down in that mine, because that would have been brutal, like, trying to get to basalt. That would have been absolutely miserable. And then I see, is that, I think that's called cyclonite. Too many ores. I'm uh, not a geologist, unfortunately. But we're going to go ahead and, oops. That's okay. I think you actually regen health. And if you don't, I have a hell of a, yeah, you do. If I didn't regen health, it wouldn't matter because I have a hell of a lot more health than I did in legendary, which is ridiculous. But what is this? Fluorite, sorry. Fluorite, uh... I wonder what you use it for. Because I know cyclonite is used for TNT or uh, C4 or one of those. One of those explosives, which can be helpful for mining. So I see a... Uh, ooh! Ooh, spider! <gasps> oh, yes, 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 yes. There's going to be a treasure chest. There's going to be a treasure chest. All right, boys. Let's go ahead and get workbench. Place her down. We, uh, we need a sword. We need a sword. Right? Right? We need a sword. We should get a sword. Let's fight some freaking spiders, man. Boom. Iron sword. All right. Give me my friendly torch. Boys, it's time for battle. Salute me. I wish, I wish myself luck. Wish me luck, damn it. Some people hide in the shadows till they see the light. But I was born in the darkness fighting to survive. See, without my...